Joining us this evening, Aaron Hatt the night off. Teresa Halbach's 15-year-old sister was in court today to help the prosecution send Halbach's accused killer to prison. Chris Schiller is live at the Calumet County Courthouse and Chris, she identified two critical pieces of evidence. Yes, she did, Tammy. You know, often in a murder trial, the uh, focus is on the suspect, not the victim. But today, jurors learned of the bond between two sisters and testimony that could harm the defense. Surrounded by family, Katie Holbach walked into court and between deep breaths talked about her big sister and the things they used to do. We would watch movies or watch TV or uh, like play card games or just hang out. Did you ever go shopping with your sister, Teresa? Yes. The 15-year-old remembered teasing Teresa after she showed Katie a pair of Daisy Fuentes jeans she'd bought. I knew that Daisy Fuentes was an older person, so I told Teresa that she has old person jeans. It's important testimony because investigators found rivets from that brand of jeans in the burn pit on Avery's property, where Holbach's bone fragments were also found. But Katie had even more to say about this controversial piece of evidence. It's a blue lanyard. She told her she got it at EAA two years ago and gave it to Teresa as a gift. The fob with Teresa's car key found in Stephen Avery's trailer a few days after her disappearance. That look the same as when you gave it to your big sister, Teresa? It does. Brave testimony from a young teen who will never share with her sister again. And Tammy, that fab is a point of contention because the defense, of course, says it was planted in the trailer by police. Now,